Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, George is 64 here, aka the hypocritical gamer. Welcome to the third day of the month of love, playing Catherine. And here we are, Mr. Cheating Vincent is ready to talk to his good friend Johnny. Thing about men who cheat being cursed? Apparently, it's related to those mysterious deaths. Yeah, no Maybe, shit. Like how Paul died? Uh huh. Or it is. This is getting called the woman's wrath. <laughs> Sounds like something Erica would like to have. Hey, Paul's been here a few times, right? Yeah, he was a classmate of ours back in high school. I ran into him just the other day. Seriously? How was he? We just traded greetings, but he looked fine. Maybe I should have paid more attention. Hey, it's not your fault, man. Hmm? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> That's not something to laugh at. <laughs> Uh, okay, you have anything else to say? Uh, hold on, let me just, uh, get a drink. There we go. That's better. When you drink, you can raise your intoxication level up to three times. Uh-huh. How drunk Vincent gets corresponds to how fast he moves that night in his nightmare. That literally makes no sense, but okay. Maybe if I'd talked to Paul more, this wouldn't have happened. Okay, so no more talking to Johnny. What about Orlando? Seriously, okay, man. They say men who cheat get cursed. Curse? That's so stupid, I can't even laugh at it. <laughs> the timing's too good. Still, I can't believe you cheated. But if she's that cute a girl, maybe it's a lucky accident, huh? That is not a good way to look at that. That's only if I don't get caught. Don't say that. What am I supposed to do? Good luck keeping it a secret. Bad her. Beg for her forgiveness. This isn't something forgivable. Yeah, anything else to say, Orlando? Anything else to help with? Catherine's a good girl. You don't have to tell me that. Got a text message! You will sometimes receive text messages on your phone. Push the triangle button to look. Yeah, I know how to do that. You already taught me that yesterday. Okay. So, what do I have here? How come these are not are, are marked like as unread or something? Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, I got another congratulations, huh? You have to go to rewards to see the stuff. Yay. Okay. Anyway, Yep. Oh, by the way, um, for those of you who are like, oh, don't try to go uh, think of this as order and chaos or whatnot. Just do what you would do. Guys, I would go the order way. If this was real life, everything I've answered thus far is how I would actually do this in real life. Because I like peace. That is, that is me. And I, I do not feel good like uh, doing like the bad things. Like if I played Fable... I tried going the evil villain route, and I couldn't do it. I just felt like a piece of shit. <laughs> anyway, um, talk to Toby. You and Catherine have been together a long time, right? What was it like in the beginning? I just want to know for reference. <laughs> uh, the beginning is literally Special. the easiest the part. He was given her dating advice, then he ended up falling for her himself, right? He ran to her side in the middle of the night when she was depressed, after all. Hey, stop that. Oh. Stand up guy like that turns out to be a cheater. Seriously. Anything else, Toby? You're sensitive, aren't you? You don't look it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, shut up. Alright. Uh oh. We got something. Who's it from? Are you at SS again? Are you out drinking again? I came by your apartment today, but you weren't there. I want to talk to you about something, but I'll do it tomorrow. Oh yeah, your plate is filthy. I told you you have to empty the trash more often. I took it out this time, but start being more careful, okay? That's all. Good night. Hmm. Sorry I wasn't home. Or just bad timing, I guess. I can drink if I want. Don't you? So don't touch my stuff. <laughs> oh, come on. I mean... It was nice of her to take out her, your trash for you, although I never really did like it when people got all nitpicky about how you took care of your own stuff, so I'd be like, yeah, 
Uh, I don't know. I probably wouldn't uh, talk to about it over the phone. So sorry, I wasn't home. Or just bad timing, I guess. Uh, yeah, it's just just bad timing, I guess. Uh, we'll talk tomorrow. Or sorry, I'm too tired to talk right now. Or we'll talk tomorrow. Was that the same thing? Yeah. Okay. We'll talk tomorrow, definitely. Good night. See ya. Man, I'm sleepy. Good night. <laughs> I like that one. Just bad timing, I guess. All right. Uh, yeah, that's good. Off you go. Whoa, that was a little chaotic. Hmm. Oh well, I I don't know. I I, I like. Uh, th that was funny. Good night. All right. Anything else? Nope. Okay. What are the uh, other button options? Ah, oh, time to get up. No, wait. Sit back down, cause I just need to. Uh, gulp. <sighs> Shit. I've never cheated in my life before. Hold on. Let me just finish this drink before I go walking around. I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished your glass. <laughs> uh huh. The name Rum and Cola is actually a nickname. Do you know the real name of this drink? Um, uh, it's called the Cuba Libre. Oh, I did know that. Rum called for in this drink represents Cuba. This is a cocktail which mixed the national specialties of Cuba and the United States as a celebration of Cuba's independence. Yay! Cuba Libre means free Cuba. It certainly it does. differently when you know the history. And that was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Oh, thank you so much. Empty already? Empty already. Yeah, I got an order. Really? Oh. Take your order. Oh, what can I get? Ooh, we've got sake, whiskey, cocktail, or beer. I am not a big fan of beer, not gonna lie, but I do like me some whiskey. whiskey. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Hey, you guys haven't even finished your beer. Here you go. So how's work? Doing well? Hey, come on. I came here to forget about that shit. Okay, let's talk about that curse. Never mind. If you're done bringing us drinks, then scram. Oh, what a bitch. <laughs> <You're so cold. laughs> that guy's a douche. I don't like him. Gulp. I'm fine. I can. Cheating, huh? I can so stop any time I want. For it and everything will be fine. Hold on. I'll be back in a second, guys. How you doing, ladies? I can look at the middle-aged women. Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? Huh? Oh, uh, sorry for staring. <laughs> Please sit. Oh, that was weird. Have you ever heard this story before? The man who climbs the highest mountain gets his every wish granted. Ah, uh, okay. This is really starting to creep creep me out. That mountain 300 years ago and was given a fortune. It said a man climbed that mountain 700 years ago and was given the world. A man who climbs the mountain now will be given his future to do it as he pleases. So pretty much is this a right now anyway. These are true stories. The story of Rapunzel is based on this true story. Oh. Who was able to climb a very tall tower gained his princess. Now, what will you gain? Huh? This is. Oh my God! I need to stop talking to you. Oh no! What do we got here? Is this reaching you? Coquettish cat at Chris Creos phone. <laughs> hey Vincent, if you get this, let me know. If you do, I'll send you a picture. You know you want to see it. Um. So who is this? I think I know who this is, but this is Vincent. Who is this? Do I know you? Oh, wait, wait, no, no. No. Don't message me again. Who is this? Do I know you? Uh, okay. Let's, uh, be polite. I know who it is. I'm almost certain, especially since... I'm not gonna say she, but... Especially since she offered me a picture. I wonder if Mr. Morgan is coming tonight. 
I wonder if I can see Mr. Morgan tomorrow. Listen, Lindsay, ma. <laughs> you got mail. Yeah, I do. Oh, no. Oh, Midnight Venus? Time passes when you sit down and talk to people in the bar. Customers will come and go while you do this. Standing up, drinking, and checking your phone, playing the arcade machine, and using the jukebox don't make time pass, so nobody will go anywhere while you're doing those things. Remember this. Okay. Good to know. Did you guys get me a drink? No? Okay, well, I'm out of here. Yeah, okay. Who else do we got here? What's up, man with glasses? <gasps> talk to other customers. The man with glasses! About their words. Oh, I totally know who this is. From time to time. This is the sheep with glasses. No leads today either. Yeah, he's a, he's a reporter. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, does that mean that this guy is the regent? Two guests. Listen, Archie, yeah, man with regent hair! A better man. I don't know how you're ranking it, but I'm not desperate to climb the social ladder. Men are only acknowledged by their upward mobility. Don't be a tumbleweed. Be like Ivy. Always climbing. That's weird. Alright, what do we got? I'll sit down, I guess. This customer is a journalist. I, I noticed. He seems to be obsessing over a certain legend lately. I think I know which legend. legend. I was originally looking into these suspicious deaths that have been happening lately. I'm Justin, by the way. Hmm. Have I met you somewhere before? Yes. Think of it. Um, I'm sure I've seen you before. Oh, sorry. We were talking about the legend. So, anyway, does Awake Us have any idea what's going on in the dream? Do we remember? This occurred in hundred-year cycles. Many men died last time as well. It's the truth. Wow. Well, every hundred years, huh? I found a strange variation on this legend going around too. Uh huh. There's a man who survives it. <gasps> survives the dreams. Very, very rarely, there's a man who is cursed but doesn't die. Isn't that interesting? It's totally it's gonna be me. Survivors granted one wish. If he wished for eternal youth, he might still be around. <laughs> it's like a magic lamp. Well, if this is what you're coming up with, you have a wish in mind for yourself? Mm, to live forever? But too typical? Me? I wish for something different. Uh huh. Like what? What is it? I may wish to change the past. Like someone kill me. What? <laughs> I wonder what I'd wish for. That's uh depressing. Let me introduce you. This is Todd, and this is Archie. Thank you, boss. Are you on your way home from the office, or not? You're not wearing a suit. A suit? Oh, I don't have that kind of job. That's what is your job? You're not one of our customers, then. What do you mean? We make business suits. Haven't you ever heard of Bantam suits? Nope. Have you heard the jingle? You'll be the cock of the walk in a Bantam. Oh, you're from Catherine's company. Hey, I think I've heard your voice before. Huh? Have we met? Uh, yes, we did. So I'll just say maybe. But, but I don't remember anything. Todd's a hard guy to forget. His hair looks like a rooster, doesn't it? That's enough cockadoodlery out of you. Ha ha ha! Uh, what else do you have to say? Like I like my blankets. Replaced by a maid every morning. You mother... <laughs> are you talking about? Time will slowly pass each time you sit and talk to people. Uh-huh. Have fun with the other bar patrons. Over time, the people and the conversation topics will change. Ooh, somebody either just came in or left. You can go home at any time from the door in the front. Okay, what about, uh... Uh-huh. Those mysterious weakening deaths. I can't believe that Paul's dead. That is all the information we have up to this point. We'll revisit our top story after the local weather, in the event that there are any updates to the situation. Have you played that Rapunzel game over there? Some stages are supposed to be impossible, but they're a cinch if you've got technique. Oh boy! I'm pretty good at coming up with techniques. Uh, I think I'll go home for today. My head hurts. All right, see you later, Todd. All right. What about you, boss? Yeah, I wonder if the woman's wrath her I heard about from Erica is real. She said that I was going to die somewhere along the line. That's uh. Apparently, I have a wanting look to my eyes. 
Would I be cursed for unfaithfulness for this too? Whatever. Still, she really Close your mouth, mouth, dude. <laughs> Woman's dearest delight is to wound man's self-conceit. Uh, to wrangle the words of a certain someone. You but tell me, do I look vain or otherwise untoward? I don't know, but in Erica's case, it's a bit different. Yeah. Anyway, let's both avoid ending up cursed and dead. I think I'm already cursed. I'm gonna head home. Excuse me. Alright, see you later, dude. I can talk more to the boss, but, you know, let's check see if there's anybody else here. Hello? Literally anybody else. Can't go that way, I guess. Uh-huh. Can't go that way. Alright, can I talk to Erica? Hey, Erica. Still, you're cheating? That's big news. Don't you care about Catherine? Well, yes. Of course, but... I feel like I wasn't even involved with it. Well, you were. I hate to be so confrontational, but jeez. Men who cheat are cursed. If that rumor is real... What is with that noise whenever the pink thing comes on? Alright, what else do you have to say? Catherine started dating you because she just couldn't leave you alone. You're stupid in all the right ways. It tickles her maternal instincts. Oh, that does not make me feel good. Personality like hers is usually attracted to mind like yours. Yeah, it kind of makes sense. What else you got? If that rumor is real, what are you going to do? I'm going to climb. It's not real. I'm going to fly high. Okay. All right, I've got a little bit more to talk to with boss apparently. Yep. Come in to see Erica. It's great for me. That's why she's allowed to say whatever she wants, apparently. Make death threats. It's late. It certainly is. Anyway, I can't hurt her anymore. Hey. Hey, Vincent. We're all heading home. How about you? Uh, well, I think I'll stay and drink a little more. Uh huh. <sighs> How long are you going to be drinking there? Hurry up and come. Oh no. Hey, come here. Oh no. Voice. Should I have left sooner? Uh, uh Maybe I can Is this a door? Can I leave? Oh I can. What about my drinks though? Ah! Oh no! <laughs> okay. I should... I really shouldn't talk to her. I really, really shouldn't. Oh, but... I don't know, I kinda... I don't know. Ah, screw it, I'm gonna... This, no, it's a bad... It's a bad decision. Do not talk with the girl that you cheated on with. If you, if you don't want to be a cheater anymore. Uh-huh. What if I just... Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I kind of want to talk to her. But... You know what? Screw it. I'm returning home. Hey, are you going home? Uh, I have stuff to do. I have something to do. Uh, oh. Well... <laughs> I'm glad I got to see you tonight. Y yeah. You can't go on your way home. Uh, girl from last night. Get away from me, you psycho. Okay. I didn't I didn't drink as much as I could have if I wanted to be faster. But you know what? I think I'll be okay. Am I still I am going to get the worst case of kidney stones. Drink some water, He's god damn it. My mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Well, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. Dude, you need to confess. This stuff is going to be messing with your head until it kills you. Literally. Uh, I, I just realized I never got a response to that who is this text. Hmm. Very interesting. Third day nightmare. Tonight's area is the 
torture chamber. Oh, good. Traitors are put to rest. Where traitors are put to rest? What if we just didn't uh, go any further? Okay. Here we are. Torture chamber. Of the deadly climb begins here. Uh huh. Looks like I only have like two stages this time around. Trap blocks activate when you step on them. Don't stop on top of them. Okay. Do not stop on top of them. Please tell me I will not be chased Damn this time. Yen? What is oh, this? Uh huh. Excuse me. That's a trap block. Woohoo! That was amazing. Excuse me. D nope. I just want to. Uh, 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 uh. Excuse me. Okay. Uh, uh, there we go. Woohoo! <laughs> All right. I shall. Can't move that one because it has a symbol on it. That's right. All right. Excuse me. Oh, oh, what is this? Excuse me. Oh, no, 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 no. You bastard. What am I supposed to do now? I'll take this. Oh, no. Okay, that was close. Huh, no. There we go. Oh, it's gone. Oh, that's just mean. Excuse me. I'll take that. Woo. All right. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> okay. And uh, let me see. What else will I do? Um, I try. I'm trying to see here. I'll just fall from here. Uh huh. Uh, excuse me. Okay. There we go. There we go. Excuse me. Uh huh. What? Oh, great. Did I? Have I messed up? No, I, I didn't mess up. Hold on. Good. Good. Uh, there we go. Good. 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 Alright, good. We're doing good. Excuse me. Woohoo. Uh-huh. No. Let go. Thank you. Uh, okay. Now, um... Do I... Yeah, okay. Good. Uh-huh. Excuse me. Ah, oh, no! Move! Thank you. Excuse me. Sorry about that, buddy. But it's... It was necessary. Okay. Now, um... Good. We're doing good. We're doing real good. I'll take that. All right. I'll take that. Off we go. I certainly did get it. Ah, uh, okay. Excuse me. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing. Uh, maybe, maybe we aren't doing good. Uh oh. Hmm. Oh, here we are. Duh. Got it. Checkpoint. Aha! Uh -huh. Woo do 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 do! Oh! That guy totally took my money, and I was not okay with that. Um. Okay, I just wanna. I would like to. There we go. Here we are. Here we are. What is that thing? That is what I would like to know. What if I? Okay, I. Oh, it's gone! No! Oh, get out of my way! All right. Excuse me. Ah, no, you don't. Uh huh. Um, wait a second. Did I do that wrong? I think I did. I'll just take that. Then I will. Oh no! Okay, I'm messing up here. Wait. Excuse me! Get out of my way! Oh, great. Come on. Okay, come on. Let's 
think things through here. No. Alright, what if I... Really? I can't? Alright, I'm trying to think what to do here. Alright, let's... What can I do here? I am... I'm trying... I, I want to use my create a block thing, but I don't know where to put it. Uh-huh. Oh, come on. This is not good at all. I don't... I messed up somehow. Oh, great. Perfect. All right, once again we go again. Get out of here. Okay, now let's be methodical about this. Excuse me, get out of here. I don't want you to, uh, get in my way. Actually, hold on a second. Ah, go over here. There we go. Good. If you'll excuse me. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no. That was not good. I was so close, too, to the end. That is not a good way. Excuse me. All right, what else can I do? Pull that out. Uh-huh. And, uh... Let me see here. Uh-huh. Excuse me. Good. Uh-huh. Uh, you'll excuse me. Good. Good. All right, I will just go this way now. I will grab that, whatever the Remove enemies! I guess that's helpful. All right, what else can I do now? Um... I'm trying to think what I can do. All right, I shall... Oh, what do I do? Can I do this? You'll excuse me, I... I just... I just wanna... Oh no, I wanna... This is not working out the way I wanted because I wanted to... I wanted to do this. Oh no. Oh, great. Of course. This isn't hard. Why am I having so much trouble? Oh, I don't want that stupid book anyway. Forget that stupid book. Okay. Oh, uh, wait, no. Let me see what I can do here. Uh-huh. Uh, let's, uh... Ooh, let's pull this up. Up we go. Okay. Up we go. And, uh... Pull that one. And that one. Good. Excuse me. Okay. Yeah! Okay. There we go. I did it! Alright, plus I kind of didn't realize at the time. I just realized that uh, once the spikes go up once, that's it. Like, they're not going to go up again. I didn't realize that at first. But now I do, so hooray! I overcame it. Oh, I don't know. If Catherine is not a psycho killer, I would love to say please let me know, but that would be spoilers. Okay, what's up, sheep with sunglasses? Hey, you there. The sheep that's just standing around. Yeah, you already said you there. Okay. I'm looking out my for myself. I'm clueless too. I don't know where the hell I am either. How dare you talk to me like that? You're a sheep. <laughs> I'm the to a big corporation. I'm a VIP. Why am I even bothering talking to a sheep? Stand up and stop complaining. All we can do is keep climbing. Shut up! I know. Okay. Oh, you have more to say. Making me do this. Okay. That great. That was. Uh, you guys got anything new to tell me? I got a technique. For you. Yeah. Please tell me. Let's do it. Okay. Explain the spider. Go on. If there's a block in your way, 
Try dangling off the edge and moving around. Uh huh. It's a useful way to go around the block to find another place to stand. I see that. By moving around, you can skip having to move blocks. Fair enough. You let your guard down. I wonder if my girl's the witch. Oh, you mean the one from the rumors? She got all worked up all of a sudden for no reason the other day. Uh huh. She's just stabbing her dinner with her fork, man. I thought she was gonna reach over and gut me. Maybe you just like those kind of women. Men who want to control women tend to have a desire to be controlled by women. It's the truth. That's kind of a thing. Want to talk about techniques? Um, is this the same thing? Let's do it. Allow me to explain. Yep. If there's yep. A, it's yep. A yep. Thank you. you mustn't let your okay. What about you? Sheep with glasses? Who, me? Come on. Oh, well, thank you very much. I'll join you. Sure. First, here's a technique I thought of. Go on. Allow me to explain the bridge. Uh, we already. Oh, okay, the bridge. Move a bridge that way. You can reach the other side of the gap. Sounds like a good idea. I don't think I've come across something like that yet, though. Oh, what about this thing? Allow me to explain the flying bridge. Aha! Pretty cool, pretty clever. I I can see that. Then add another block next. Wow, I knew it. You're not just a regular guy. You're welcome. I totally thought of that all by myself. I think that'll help me beat the next area. Oh, really? Will it help me? Ooh. Do you want to review the technique? Um, sure. Just to get rid of the whole I talked to you. Okay. Yep. 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 Uh, know the bridge. Yep. Once more, Use the flying bridge. bridge. That's really cool, buddy. All right, we did it. What about you, friend? Look around. It's obvious. Is it obvious? Down here last night, and I'm still here. Does that mean we have to keep going every night until we die? Maybe. 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 Have you seen them? Yeah, those two sheep who attack you while you're climbing. I'm trying to follow you or what? Uh, no. They're just crazy. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I've done it too. Seriously? Yeah, I, I did it too, buddy. The blood is on my hands. Gross. Again, I'm not exactly sure what would happen, uh, like if this is a long-haired sheep. Great. Like pu if pushing them off does anything bad. Hey, hey there, merchant sheep. You got anything to sell to me? Seen them lying around while you're climbing. I have like ten thousand useful items for them. Uh huh. Would you rather have coins than an item? I'm a numismatist. I love money. There's nothing in life money can't buy. Uh huh. I put that on into my office. No matter what world you're in, as long as you've got money, you can do anything. Really? Gold coins are symbols, symbolizing money. And if that's the case, then I can save myself if I have enough of it. That's my theory, right? Oh, so you don't know. If you are still having trouble getting to the stage, you can buy items with coins. Yep. If you are already carrying an item, it will be replaced if you buy a new one. Be careful. Okay. However, buying items makes it more difficult to earn the gold prize. Oh, I haven't even gotten a gold prize yet. An item, only have some coins. Tonight's product is... Yeah. The bell changes the blocks around you into normal blocks. The energy drink allows you to climb two blocks at once. Oh, that energy drink would be pretty useful, but why is the uh, male symbol on these? I don't know. I'm not gonna buy anything. No, I don't need it. Huh? You think you're window shopping or something, pro man? <laughs> so my sheep with afro. And why does he have horns like that when everyone else has normal looking curly ram horns? Sheep have interesting habits. <laughs> they all follow one leader. Oh yeah? If the leader falls off a cliff, the entire group will go to its death. Interesting. Maybe we'd survive if we had a great leader. Uh, I'll be your leader. I totally won't push you off. I heard that this place has eight levels. Does that eight levels? I don't know. Long-haired sheep. Paying attention in the confessional. There's someone in the real world who wants me dead. Yeah, I've heard. 
think of anyone who would do that? Yeah, I can. A lot of them. A lot? But this curse is nothing compared to there. Is this that Toby guy? You escaped from hell? Uh huh. Alright, we'll see you later. <laughs> okay, well, I think we shall do the confessional next time around. So, thank you all very much for watching. So, until we meet again, this has been George64, aka The Hypocritical Gamer. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>